today we're going to do some uh, gelatin flowers, fantasy gelatin flowers. They're fantasy because they're not real looking, they're fantasy, but they're really, really cool. Uh, and one thing is that they last a lot and they don't break like uh, the flower paste could break sometimes. We're going to do this one to do a uh, sort um, of have hibiscus. I bought the templates in gelatin designs online so uh, you can find these templates online or you can buy them at your local cake design store for this as you can see in the template i don't know if you can see here it has all the veins but it also has like a middle part in this middle part we're going to place wire i already cut about I don't know a third of the whole like one wire I call it I cut it a uh, flower wire I cut it in three parts and this is going to go right here in the middle and it's going to dry together with the gelatin so your petal will be ready to assemble we're going to start by I'm going to just put it this way because it's easier for me to brush it let me just find my brush I have a big um, a big brush very um, soft hair so it will mark the strokes so I'm just going to and I have already my color gelatin that I am, you already have the recipe and you already have all the details on how to color it so I'm going to start by just brushing the first one and when I have it all covered I will add, whoops, sorry. I will add the wire. Wait for it. Okay, I have a small space here to work. So I'm just going to add the wire here. Here you go, now is it in place? And then I'm going to pass again the brush on top of it so it will stick here you go okay next one brush it first with the gelatin preparation once it's all covered add the wire you have all the markings in there so it should be easier for you to add the wire that it's already it already sticks because of the gelatin and then brush it on top okay good so I'm going to repeat this in all of the leaves and then I'm going to let so it here they dry. are all the petals are done all the wires are in place I'm now gonna leave it to rest until tomorrow so I can take off each petal and then I'm just going to cut around the edges with a scissor and I will have my petals run, uh, my petals, sorry, done to ensemble. So let's just wait for it to be ready. 